CSP, there's different types of transforms. If you go edit, transform, you can, you can see all of them. We'll be focusing on free transform today. Free transform lets you uh, do this. There's a cool trick for drawing backgrounds where you free transform a top view layout, skew it into perspective, then use it as a guide to draw. Instead of using a top view layout, we'll just use a simple grid. Now this technique only works with image material layers. So if your layer is in raster or vector, be sure to convert layer and click image material. Okay, now on to animating it. You don't need an animation folder for this. You can just have the layer and then enable keyframes. But if you go to keyframe and then try to drag it around, you can see it seems to only scale and rotate. That's because in order to let CSP know that you're trying to keyframe in free transform, before going into keyframe mode, you have to free transform it slightly. So after that, if you go keyframe mode, then you should be able to skew it by holding control. CSP automatically places the keyframe whenever we move the grid, so I'll just move it from this frame, then I'll just skew it this way. Then once I move it, it should move. Cool. I just want to let you know there's three different types of keyframes, but I'll make another video on that and the graph editor later. Here's a quick bouncing ball. It's good for character animation and background animation if you're into that. You can try doing the same thing by copy pasting a perspective layer, but in my opinion, I find the moving grid more versatile. And plus, using this method, it doesn't even show in the playback. Yeah, anyways, I hope this video helped, and if all else fails, just use Blender, lol.